Active noise cancellation, aka ANC, has become a fever amongst headphone manufacturers. Popular brands like Apple, Sony, Bose, and all others are now competing to achieve the title of King of Noise Cancellation. But among so many ANC earbuds and their benefits, there's also an argument about is noise cancellation bad for your ears? Well, in today's video, we'll analyze the nature and effects of ANC so that you can get rid of all the confusion for good. So without further ado, let's get started. It has been many decades since the noise cancelling technology was invented in 1989 by Dr. Lawrence Fogel. But in today's world, they have been more popular because people love to play competitive games or stream their favorite music all the time. As a result, the headphones with ANC offer the cleanest and noise-free sound to achieve a pitch-perfect music experience while traveling in any outdoor environment. But still, there are some arguments that ANC may cause some issues to your ears. Is this really true? We will be able to decide that after knowing how ANC works. When you put on headphones, a lot of noise from your surrounding comes with transmitted audio. Headphones with ANC have tiny microphones inside. They capture sounds before your ears receive and use pre-circuitry diagnosis to detect the noise frequencies. Then, they generate the opposite frequency and the noise gets eliminated by each other before you hear it. Right at this point, some people enjoy the music more than before. But again, some people with ultra-sensitive eardrums can find the generated noise and pressure annoying. Keep notes that a general study describes that hearing low frequency at a constant rate can result in headaches, insomnia, stress, and so on. So is the ANC leading to health and ear damage silently through low noise? The answer is no. In fact, the lower frequencies are much less powerful than the surrounding noises. So mainly the probability of sickness depends on the person who is listening to it. Research from the Acoustical Society of America says that children living in low noisy neighborhoods have higher levels of cortisol, which increases the stress hormone. Using headphones with ANC can actually minimize that excessive noise and cortisol successfully. Even if the ANC makes a micro hissing sound when idle, it does not generate any radiation like other wireless devices. Moreover, the headphones with ANC cancel out all the unwanted noise, so you don't have to raise the song's volume, which protects you from high decibel sounds. Also, ANC headphones have gaps between the ear pads and your ears, allowing you to have free space without any pressure and sweating. So, we can say that noise cancelling headphones are actually a great deal with their ability to block you from the surrounding noisy environment. They just remove the noise to improve your listening experience. However, all you need to do is pay attention to the volume levels on your headphones, because the intensive volume may bring discomfort to your ears. So now you know definitely whether ANC is good or bad for you, and can pick your favorite active noise cancelling headphones without any doubt. Like, comment, and share this video if you find it helpful. And subscribe to our channel for more videos.